so I'm just on my way to go get a haircut. I hate my layers right now. I feel like they're not like how I would usually want them. So hopefully she can fix it and give me Bollywood hair. But yeah, I'm here now. So I'm just getting my haircut right now. Um, I can see the layers coming along. They're looking much better. Use my videos. I have to. So you give it credit. Yeah, I have to ask for permission. No, I just have to say what song it is. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Super loud. I just got my haircut. As you can see, my layers are finally normal. So I just want to thank Dilshan, and she works here at Mira's. And um, for those of you who don't know, Dilshad was actually um, Shah Rukh Khan's hairstylist for many years and she moved here about a couple years ago and I'm so glad I got to meet her and that she literally works a block away from my house. So from now on, I will only get my hair cut from her. But yeah, I'm so glad my hair is finally normal. I, looks, I feel like a Bollywood star. Anyways, I shall see you later. Loving my layers. They're nice and short and then they get longer and longer. And then it's like, I love the short layers as well in the front. They're kind of like grown up bangs and I like that because when I curl my hair, I flip it outwards. But yes, that's my hair and I love it. Just waiting for my sister to straighten her hair and then we're going out for dinner to an oyster place. Why would she I don't train? eat oysters. Hello. <laughs> So they're trying oysters. I refuse to. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> oh, I'm not looking forward for that to go on YouTube. Oh, oh shit. Number two, number two. There's two, you need to up. No. We're already here. We're actually open it. Then. How do you open it? I'm caught. Oh. Are we stuck? Please don't be. No, Door open, open right there on the left. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> so oh, I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna have a panic attack. <laughs> hey guys, so it's 4 a.m. and I'll try talking quietly because my parents are asleep. But um, I just made a bangle set. This is what it looks like. I think it's good enough. I'm only gonna wear one on each arm because I only have two of these big bangles because they're pretty expensive. And I decided to just put them on the ends, and that's for this outfit, the one where. In my last vlog, I said I couldn't find bangles to match, but I think the green's good enough. And then for that orange and um, green outfit, I made this one. I didn't put any orange in it just because I want to focus on green. Like, I'm wearing this jewelry with it. And I'll probably wear a round green bin. You guys know how I was looking for Ron Lila earrings, and... Um, well, I actually forgot that I owned these earrings, and they're actually pretty close enough. I found them in this box. This is, I keep all my jewelry in, like, a big box like this, and I was just going through it and realized I actually own a pair that's pretty close. And I was going to order a pair online, but I don't think I have enough time, considering I leave next week for California. So these ones we'll just have to do. Oh, and I wanted to share something with you guys. I'm not sure um, what my viewers out there actually sh um, store their bangles on, but I bought these little racks from, uh, you can find them at Walmart or Target. Um, I bought mine at Zellers, but as you guys know, here in Canada, they changed all the Zellers into Targets. And yeah, there's actually their tie racks, and they're really good for storing your bangles. I've got like three, actually I've got four. I've left one in my room. Um, but yeah, they're really good for keeping your bangles, and you can like create your little sets and put them on here. And yeah, just thought that was a little tip I would share with you guys. But yeah, I'm going to continue packing, so I'll see you guys later. So yeah, it's almost 3 in the morning, and this is what these two are sitting here doing. You know, no big deal, just doing hair. Are you guys enjoying your pink orchid course? Yeah. Yep. Cool. You better be making me proud there. We try. Please sometimes. don't embarrass me, please. That's that is all I ask. <laughs> Anyways, I forgot to mention earlier. Look what I got today. Bombay hair extensions. I got these and they are in black beauty because my hair is super dark. And the five in one curling wand. Ta-da! So all of you viewers who've been asking me to make hair tutorials, I will be making them soon. A bunch of them. Yeah. Anyways, I'll show you guys their finished product after. 
Ravina's doing my hair today, and I'm just gonna sit here and eat Oreos. Yum. She needs practice. Don't mind my ratchet lipstick. I'm just uh, trying out a new product to see if I like it or not. And so this is where I get my nose rings from. It's a store called Bibli Fashions, and that is it. So let's just go inside. I didn't get to show you guys what these look like in the store because it's super awkward to vlog when people are staring at you and wondering what the hell you're doing. But these are the nose rings I got and that's what they look like and you kind of just slide them up your nose. <laughs> Literally. Yeah. Do you like? Bye. Don't you hate when you get your eyebrows done and there's like little hairs all over your face? I hate that. So I just came to get my nails done and look how much my old nails have grown. Like I've never had my old nail look so good. And then this is what it looks like after she took it off. So I'm very happy. And I got my nails done from Jyoti. And do you want to tell my YouTube viewers a little bit about what you do and what products you use and why you're so amazing? <laughs> That's right. I am amazing. Yes, um, you are. I've been doing nails. It's going to be eight years next year. Yeah. And uh, basically, it's called Accents Gel. It's made right here in Vancouver. Mm -hmm. It's a local product. And um, it's amazing in the sense that it does not damage your natural nails. It's not toxic. Yeah. Um, it lasts, like this is like over four weeks worth of growth yeah. without any issues. And your natural nail is basically, as you can see, not like red or bleeding or like has fungus or anything like funky like that. <laughs> and it's that. not thin and like um, you brittle know or Yeah, you, when you get acrylic, they're like bendy, like you know? Yeah, so there's thin. no issues like yeah. that. And it just looks really natural and feels really natural. You can't even tell if there's anything on your nail, which is the best part. That is like the most amazing part. Yeah. And it helps your nail plate grow. Like we started off with nails that were like yeah, this big. You and can like, see where, how much my real nails grow. It's yeah. amazing. And Mona was just saying that she's never had her natural nails be this long. And the difference between this product and acrylic. And shellac. And shellac. Mm -hmm. So acrylic and shellac are um, products that have to be re removed with acetone. Whereas this, we basically just buff it off so your fingers are not being soaked in yeah. chemicals. And you don't get that like dent of where you can tell where it, like the, the product, product was. was. Yeah. yeah, exactly. And so also with shellac, it's not a gel. It's actually a replacement for nail polish and it's supposed to only last a little bit longer than polish. That's yeah. it. I don't know why it's being advertised as gel. Yeah. Maybe because it can be cured in a UV light. Yeah. Probably. But the way that they apply it is it's just thin layers. Um, just like a polish and so many of my new clients have issues with peeling and lifting and breaking mm -hmm. um, because they're expecting it to be strong but your nails are not going to be strong yeah so an acrylic of course it's just it's all chemical it doesn't look natural yeah. it really damages your nail whereas this is just it's in a league of its own so my shape's coming along nicely now and, and that's my yeah. nail plate is that's my real nail like this part has grown so much. It was yeah. Like really half the size. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on, don't talk for a sec. Hey guys, so this is the finished product of my nails. I really like them. This first time I'm trying the almond shaped, and I didn't get the claw shape because those nails kind of scared me a little bit. I don't want them super pointy. And yeah, blinged on the corners. Super pretty. I love it. Thank you, Jyoti. Just getting my Mindy done by Fatma. And I'm getting circle design. Thank you, Fatma. <laughs> like it? Yes, I love it. Can't wait to see it. 
All done packing. I'll see you guys in my next vlog in San Francisco. See my toes. I got my toes done this week too. I've already messed one up. There's like a dent in it. I don't know. Wait, can you see that? Oh well.